to a sensational episode of Making It With Darren. I'm your host, Darren Barr. Thank you guys for joining me tonight. We're doing something a little bit different, something fun. Um, I was talking to my buddies over at sudsorduds.com, Suds or Duds TV. These are two goofy guys that we love. Um, they basically sample the brewskis for the uskis, is, is how they put it, Greg, I believe. Um, they get a couple different beers each time. They sample them out pour them into some mugs, test them, tell us a little bit of history about them. So I was talking to them today, told them I was going to be making an episode. I uh, wanted to find out what beer would go good with our uh, meal that we'll be making. They told me that this uh, Whitmer Hefeweizen was really great, goes well with what we'll be making. So we wanted to give it a try, give those guys a shout out, say hello. And uh, they said we had to have a little lemon. So Greg, I'm going to pour a little lemon into each of these. Mm-hmm. And uh, we'll start pouring this, and we'll give this a whirl. See what uh, see what we think. I'm a big Hefeweizen guy. I like I like wheat beer. You know. Yeah, the lemon's good. Oh yeah. Well, look at this head on this thing, man. Ooh wee! All right. Well, cheers, brother. Cheers. Well, that was all head. That's all right. So, Greg, when you put your beer down, we'll roll over this way. Today we're going to be making something pretty cool. It is uh, mushroom sliders. Now, it's not your typical little slider with a little bun with some sautéed mushrooms. No, screw that. We're going full out mushroom sliders. So what we've got are some nice portobello mushrooms, some caps. See here? Mm. And I'm going to show you what we're going to do. We're basically going to infuse these, stuff these, okay, with turkey meat. And first what you have to do is you have to destem these things. They've been wiped clean. And what you do is you put a little pressure on the stem on your thumb, and then they'll come out perfectly like that. Mm. Okay? And then what we're going to do is we're going to get a little bit of turkey meat. That's been sitting here, just some ground turkey meat. I'm going to kind of uh, turn this into a little patty here. We're going to put that right into our mushroom. So you see it's one nice, perfect little patty there. Mm. Grab this towel here, wipe this off. And uh, we're going to move on with some seasonings on here. We've got a little paprika that we're just going to hit that with. And a little lemon pepper. And I've got some uh, McCormick's Spicy Steak Seasoning, Montreal Steak. I love this stuff. Uh, You guys can find it at any store. They've got spicy, they've got regular, they even have low sodium. Um, We're just going to hit it with a little bit of that. And a splash of Worcestershire for good measure. Then this whole thing can go straight into the Tyson grill or the Foreman grill. You know, if you guys have a regular grill, please use it. You know, we're just making do with what we got for right now. Um, You can use your broiler in your oven, which is really great. But for right now, we're just going to cook this. This should only take about, I don't know, 12 to 15 minutes max. Um, but we'll, uh, we'll be timing it exactly in the foreman because I haven't done this before and we'll let you know exactly how it turns out. We'll check back in a little bit and we'll plate our meal. I really do like this beer. This was from uh, episode 3 on Suds or Duds. And we're going to link all their stuff up so you guys can check them out. It's cool to kind of match up beer and food. And, you know, We're all about good drinks and good food here on Making It With Darren. So. Well, my burger, my mushroom slider is still cooking. I didn't really tell you what's going on. I kind of rushed into it a little bit. Here's what's going on right here. And we're basically infusing the patty and the mushroom together so we have one nice patty. We're going to do this bunless. We're going to serve a nice, like, uh, spinach salad on top of it. It's going to be very light. Um, A little bit on the healthier side compared to some of the other stuff I've made. And, uh, you know, it's great for any time. I mean, you can throw these things on the grill in mass quantities. Serve them with cheese. You can put them in buns if you want. Um, I like them like this because it's got a great presentation. Uh, I've got some of my favorite honey mustard dressing. Brands is excellent. All of their stuff has really been top-notch every time I use it. So we're going to get some fresh uh, baby spinach that we've chopped up a little bit here. I'm just going to toss it into this big bowl. We're going to toss it with a uh, little bit of this Brianne's honey mustard. Just get a little drizzle on there. Just give it a nice toss. Usually I use my hands. They're the best tools in the kitchen, but yeah, why not? I got two spoons here. So that's going to sit and hang out. And when our burger is ready, you think this might be about done? 
It's getting there. Ooh, it looks good to me. Yeah, it looks pretty good to me too. I I'm thinking we'll give it like maybe another minute maximum. And we'll go ahead and we'll start plating this whole bad boy. Now just so you know again, we use Worcestershire. Just a little bit over the top. You guys can use uh, soy sauce in your patties. I know that with turkey burgers, a lot of people like to use beaten eggs and breadcrumbs and all sorts of things to hold the burger together. You're absolutely welcome to do that. Like I said, your favorite way of making um, a turkey burger or a burger works great. You're just going to stuff it in a mushroom instead of in a bun. So this is probably done. Let's go ahead and let's pull this off. I'm going to grab this fork here. I love this George Foreman. I know. And you know what? I, I, I probably need to get one of these. It cooks quick. Yeah, it does. And that probably was about, actually, that was exactly five minutes. So it's pretty fast. Uh, uh, how hot? Uh, that was at 340 degrees. The setting was 340. So if you're using a, a grill, you're going to want a medium, medium high setting on that. So we're going to go ahead and just toss this lettuce. Look at this. I'm dropping things as always on top of that. And we're going to go ahead and just get a nice slice of tomato going here. Nice thick wedge of tomato. And that's it. That is our mushroom slider. Mm. Yummy.